but when the Barons and Titans met in a basketball game this morning, they did it in the spirit of bringing their communities together to help students with special needs enjoy the thrill of victory as a packed house cheered them on. Lisa Lane has the story. Ready for this? Ready for this? Let's go, man. Here we go. High fives, high fives. Woo! Honestly, it just brings a sense of joy and pride. In front of a packed gymnasium, East Lake and Bonita Vista High School students and their Baron Buddy peers cruised up and down the court in an emotional basketball game. The feeling is just unbearable. It's just the emotions are going high. It's just it's just awesome to feel like we are all one. We are all the same. We are all the same. I'm like kind of hiding back the tears right now because it's how emotional it was to me. But it was it's perfect, beautiful. Hey, get into it. That's it. That's woo. There you go. Oh. Baron buddies consist of a group of students with special needs, and throughout the school year, they're paired with peers from the high school to create a sense of unity and companionship. That same message of equality was felt from the court up to the top of the bleachers today and the event hosted by Bonita Vista. United, you know, and that's what this pr the purpose of this event was, is United Sports Event. You know, and just the fact that different social groups got together, different schools got together, the fact that we're united as one, that's beautiful. And that just shows that 50 years have, that we've been here, how strong our pride is. And it doesn't matter if it's Bonita winning or if it's Eastlake winning, no matter what, we're in this together. Today, it didn't matter if you're a Baron or a Titan. The student body showed up loud and proud, cheering and clapping for every basket that fell through the hoop. Just bringing the two schools together, it shows that when we put all of our differences aside, we can come together and act as a community. You know, um, at football games, they always say, I believe that we will win. You know, I believe that we all will win. And that's what this game proves, so it's beautiful. The atmosphere was just perfect. Everyone was cheering for everyone. No negative things. Everyone's just cheering for one. We're all one. What about down court, buddy? And a boy. I just hope that they're able to go out well and not be shy and make friends. With the game all wrapped up, everyone left feeling like a winner, and both high schools say they hope they can come together for many more events just like this one in the future. Reporting from Bonita Vista High School, I'm Lisa Lane, Fox 5 Sports. Uh, what a great game and a great program from both high schools. Tonight on Fox 5 Sports Final, we'll show you how the Padres fare against the Giants. I'm giving Kathleen some time so she can w dry her eyes over there. Plus, former Padres and current Giants manager Bruce Bochy shares his all-star game memories from his four trips to the Midsummer Classic as the National League manager. That's tonight at 1045. As a mother of two, Phil is a father. You had us going and, over here, that pal. That brings tears to your eyes to it see really that community come yeah. together like that, doesn't it? It yeah. does, and also, you know, the teenage years, you get a bad rap, and, and they can be self-absorbed, but that's natural, that sure. time of life. And to see them being so open-hearted and giving is just breathtaking. And two rival schools, yeah. bitter rivals in all that they do, coming together and everybody cheering everybody. What a uh, great... You kill me with no. these stories, <laughs> I'm telling you. Yeah, Lisa did a great job. Oh, they're great. Yeah. Thank, Thank you, you so much. Go to our website and see it again. I had